In my last video, I showed you how to change the color of a shape in After Effects. Now I'm gonna do the exact same thing in Premiere. So I've got my shape selected right here, and I'm just gonna make a brand new shape. So I just drew out a rectangle, perfect. Um, now what if I wanna make this rectangle a different color? It is not difficult. You just have to go up to your effect controls. If you don't see your effect controls, make sure that it's checked off in window. So if I go to window and then I go down to effect controls, I can see that it is checked off. So it will be one of the tabs available. You just have to find it. Um, and mine happens to be right here. You can switch through and um, this is a tab you'll use all the time. So you're probably already familiar with it. Uh, and then under graphics, you're gonna go down to shape and then you're going to expand that. Then you're going to expand appearance if it's already uh, not expanded. So I'm going to just hit the drop down, and now under appearance, I see the word fill. That is the color. So I can, I can grab another color in my comp by using the color picker like that. Now you can see I've got a dark gray here, or I can double click and fill the color on the slider and you know just change it accordingly but i like that okay uh you can also change the stroke which is pretty useful um if you want that and you can change the size of the stroke by just typing in a number or you can have no stroke at all by unselecting it and the shadow which is kind of cool and interesting and you can really play with it um look at that you can have it expanded out you can do all sorts of cool stuff here. So um, generally I'm not using the shadow very often, but it is very fun to play with. Look at that. Um, that's giving it kind of a gradient. So that's it. Uh, you can change the shape using the fill, but you have to remember to be in the effect controls and dropping down shape and appearance in order to find it. So it can feel a little hidden at first, but you will get used to it. I hope that you guys found this useful and I have a whole playlist on Premiere and beyond. So please subscribe and like, and uh, thank you so much for watching.